Restriction enzyme digestion. A restriction digestion is when DNA is digested using what is called a restriction enzyme. A restriction enzyme is a surgical scalpel. It will cut up DNA, but only where one specific sequence of base pairs exists. This sequence is usually four to six nucleotides in length and is different for every restriction enzyme. Today, we're going to perform a double digestion. Each restriction enzyme has a buffer to go with it. These are proprietary and are sent with the enzyme when they are ordered. The manufacturer of the enzyme can usually provide suggestions as to what buffer to use if you wish to perform a double digestion where the two enzymes are shipped with different buffers. 1. Add sufficient water that the total volume, when buffer enzymes and DNA are added together, total 50 microliters. 2. Add 5 microliters of the supplied 10x buffer. 3. Add 2 micrograms of the DNA you wish to digest. 4. Add 4 units of each restriction enzyme. One unit is defined as the amount of enzyme necessary to digest 1 microgram of DNA in 1 hour. For this reaction, we will digest 2 micrograms in 1 half hour. 5. Place on heating block at 37 degrees for 30 minutes. 6. In order to inactivate the enzymes, consult the manufacturer's recommendations. Often, enzymes can be inactivated by heating to 65 degrees for 20 minutes. Alternatively, it may be necessary to isolate the DNA from the protein. 7. Run the samples on a 1% agarose gel to verify that two bands have appeared which are not present in a single digested or undigested sample. In the above gel, we have three different samples. The first lane carries the standard DNA ladder. The second lane is loaded with undigested DNA. This sample shows a mass of approximately 5,000 base pairs. The second sample was digested only using ECORI. The third was digested using both ECORI and MLUI. This third sample shows a second band which results from excising the 800 base pair sequence from the sample.